All right, welcome to video one. This is what we trade, okay? We trade pullbacks from a trend. It's that simple. We, we look for strength in downtrends and weakness in uptrends. Currently, we're trading these futures instruments. Uh, as of this recording, we are trading the euro currency as well as the Russell 2000 in our trade room, but we are planning to phase out for the time being euro currency. Depending on when you're watching this video, we may have added or removed certain instruments. What we're looking for are very liquid instruments with a good bit of volatility. These are the instruments that the market makers are interested in manipulating, which means we're very interested in those instruments as well. So there may be a time where we'll switch those out. But currently, these are the instruments that we trade in our trade room. We have very small targets and very small stops. Uh, we have a lower risk uh, and lower stress. And we do have lower risk and lower stress because of the limited exposure time, the limited amount of time that we allow our money to be exposed to the market fluctuations and the aforementioned market makers. We don't want to be involved in some of the manipulations that are going on, so we want to get in and out as quickly as possible. All right, as I mentioned, we trade pullbacks from a trend, but let's look and see what, what that really means. Uh, the trend of the day here is down, but does that always mean that selling short is the safest option all day long? Does it give you the best opportunities? Uh, if, you were, if you were short here uh, and, and only wanted to trade with the trend, will you feel like that trend trading during this period of time would be in your best interest or would be particularly safe. Uh, there are so many things inside of a, uh, uh, or, or when you're looking at a long-term trend, there's an awful lot more to look at than just the trend of the day. If we look inside of a trend after zooming in for a closer look, we can still see the prevailing trend, but we also see the inevitable pullbacks inside every trend. Every trend has them. Always, trends do not and cannot move in a single direction. And at every single turning point, whether with a long-term trend or against it, we have amazing opportunities. They exist for all of us. But we have these amazing opportunities because we know with a high degree of probability why these direction changes take place and more importantly, when they are likely to take place. All right, this concludes video one in our video series. Please feel free to proceed to video two in the series to get started learning about trading trade setups.